Hi, this is Mike from the Mobile Fanatics. Today I'm going to show you a quick demo of this app called Instance for Windows Phone on my Nokia Lumia 920. Um, it actually is an Instagram app made by a third party developer. It, as you can see, it loads up pretty fast. Um, it, has, it resembles the same interface found on the official Instagram apps for iOS and Android. Scrolling is very good. Um, you can easily make comments. Right there, I just tap the comment button in the same little window. It added a, a box where I could add a comment. I could double tap to like the photo. Or I could even go here and let's see one with comments. This one has some comments. I'll tap on it once. It'll bring me to the page where I can see all the comments. And from here I could even share this photo to Facebook or Twitter. I could add a heart to it. I could save the photo to my phone. Tap the save button. This album has been saved. I'm sorry, this image has been saved to your saved pictures album. And we'll go back to the main interface. You slide over, there's recent activity um, that pertains to my account. You could go ahead from here, click on something. Here's a photo I took yesterday at my 920. You could add uh, the hashtag. You could tag people as well in your comments. So from here, if I wanted to type the at sign, it will let me, well, I could type out the name if I remember it here. It won't auto search for an, a name, which hopefully that feature comes. I could add those to people to the comments. We'll go ahead and uh, slide over. We got popular photos currently right now on Instagram. And then <clears throat> we could add a photo, either take a new one right here, or I could upload one. We'll go ahead and add this photo of the DC-16 wireless charger, or I'm sorry, portable charger. So you could pick the filters. Now these filters um, are the ones that the developer came up with. There's going to be more he could add to the application. You could choose to post it on Facebook or share it on Twitter. I'll share it on Twitter. Here I'm going to make a comment, upcoming review, reviewing this device, little portable charger here. You'll find it the review here on our channel. And then I'll write hashtag DC16. Okay. And here's well, I'll go ahead and up upload the photo. And there it is. So I just uploaded a photo to Instagram from my Windows phone. You could also search. Um, you could view your profile. See the followers if I click, tap on those. The timeline, all the photos I've uploaded, photos of me that other people have tagged me in. Um, we'll go check out some settings. Background updates enabled. So I'll get a toast notification on any screen when something new uh, happens on Instagram for me. Live tiles enabled, it'll show the number of notifications I have. And you could see the accounts I have connected to my Instagram account. The filters, you could update filters, 13 filters downloaded. Sometimes the developer could add more filters without having to update the apps, which is pretty cool. And we'll check out the live tile right here. I don't have any notifications as of right now on the instance tile, but it would show the number of notifications up at the top corner. I could also add it to my lock screen. Whether it be an image, um, I could add a notification that'll show how many notifications I have on the instance app. So there you have it. That's instance formerly known as Instagram by the developer, and he had to change the name, so they chose instance, and it's a third-party Instagram app for Windows Phone. Thanks for watching.